Good afternoon. Welcome to the inaugural Perplexing Ruins YouTube video uh, embarkation of my channel I decided to try and do. And this is just going to be a channel where I highlight in short little videos and clips things that I appreciate, things that influenced me, artwork I like, uh, talk about uh, game and tabletop things. A series of short little tiny essays, I suppose. Uh, not reviews so much as highlighting material. And I thought a great way to start that, since I'm currently trying to kickstart my game Fallen right now, I would talk about some of the things that inspired that work. Um, so for the first video, I wanted to share this small little item here. This is called Blood in the Roots, a traditional role-playing game of British folklore, designed by the heretic Scott Malthouse or Trollish Delver Games. It's just a pamphlet. I purchased this on Itch and then um, printed it out at home on cardstock. It's just got this really great woodcut aesthetic that I like. Uh, a real minimal, clean game set in the medieval times without being um, so much fantasy as folklore, which is a kind of a nice, fun take, and that's what attracted me to the game. Um, you play as hammers, which are the characters, and you get might, lore, nerve, reflex, art, defense, and stamina. Soldier, astrologer, priest, and scoundrel um, that come with predetermined stats and some starting simple equipment. Just really cool, light, simple. Uh, you roll 2d6 plus your relevant stat to make a test. Um, but the thing that uh, really caught my attention and I think is in a wonderful mechanic and um, I have placed in Fallen and uh, I wrote Scott about that because I think this is just a brilliant piece of game writing is fear when you face something horrifying for the first time you make a nerve test if you fail you take a fear token which reduces your roles in the future I have borrowed that and placed it in Fallen because I think it's a super brilliant thing to do it uh, sort of gamifies impact on players in a very clean and simple way and then Places of Peace, which is an extension of the fear. Place of Peace is a location of warmth and light, such as a church. Resting here for 1d6 hours removes all fear tokens. So I've put that in my book Fallen as well. And then I also put in Places of Disturbance, which if you have to linger in a place that on a d6 table, you find out what is your place of disturbance, and it will give you a fear token. Um, otherwise, the game is really simple. Uh, 2d6 plus might against the defense to do damage. Um, armor can be used to avoid damage. Uh, you can shatter your shield to negate all damage. It's a very cool, it encapsulates all the things we like about most of these rule -like, rules like games. Uh, and then here's Folk Core. Blood in the Roots is a game of fantasy folk core. Use the flavor guide to help create your own adventures. Rituals, cults, lurking beasts, creeping dread, and religion. And then there's a very small sample of folk creatures to kind of get you going. This is a great for like one shot kind of thing. Uh, light some candles, put on some fun dark folk music. Um, Renaissance music, I'm not sure. Uh, I don't know. I just think this is really cool. And uh, I'm really happy to have it in the collection. And uh, has inspired me quite a bit. And just a little pamphlet. So thank you. Enjoy, and we'll talk soon.